Time now is 7.50. Let us check in with meteorologist Tim Williams from CBS News Baltimore for a look at the weather. Tim, good morning. You know, throughout the morning we've been talking about this storm that is slamming a huge swath of the country, but the south is really getting hit hard, strong winds, even a possibility of tornadoes. What, what can you tell us about what's happening there? Well, Emory, first off, good morning to you. And yes, uh, the words mess come to mind. First off, you know, the temperatures are such a drastic uh, change across the country. You can't have temperatures at 71 in Miami and then 16 in Oklahoma or 60 in Boston and 6 in Minneapolis without having a problem. So the contrast is what's creating all of these issues. You know, yesterday into today, we have temperatures that are about 15 to 30 degrees warmer in the middle of the country in the heartland. That's around Tornado Alley. And then 15 to 30 degrees colder along the eastern seaboard and as a result we have all kinds of watches and warnings all of the purple you see there are winter weather advisories all of the blue are winter uh, storm warnings or wind advisories and then we have a blizzard warning up in uh, the area right around the Dakotas the storms have all been down around the south and again all of that's the result of one front that's moving on through Anne Marie so other parts of the country are dealing with snow and flooding we said everything and the kitchen sink that's what it feels like when will this severe weather stop? <laughs> Well, the timing is going to be dependent on this front. This is the culprit. You can blame everything on this front. The front has been moving on through. It really extends from the top all the way down to the Gulf of the, uh, the country, really from Canada down to the Gulf. So as it's moved on through, it's triggered severe thunderstorms even in the northeast. Cold enough behind it, though, that we've had snow. So in the south, where we've had those tornadoes down around Alabama, we've seen the problems. We have the blizzard conditions up around the north and the northwest. The blizzard conditions up there and then the tornadic activity down to the south all the result of this system. So the colder air behind it is creating the problems. It is going to start to calm down heading into this weekend. We're starting to see the snow and any problems in the morning now in the northeast starting to clear down in the south. Although the mild air retreats in South Beach is going to go from 70 degrees down into the 40s, we are starting to see things starting to clear out. So overall, it's going to be a relatively calm weekend. But again, the temperatures are going to level out. But things as far as all of those storms will level out now that that one system has gone through, but it is going to be chilly. And Marie, I'll say it's going to be kind of a comfort food, maybe Philly cheesesteak kind of a weekend if you want to settle in and uh, get away from the colder air. Mm, Tim, now you're talking my language. Yeah, you can come on here and talk about food anytime <laughs> if, if that's in exchange for, you know, talking about the sort of weather. <laughs> Tim, thank you very much. <laughs> sure, Marie, have a good weekend. You can catch Tim and the entire CBS News Baltimore team on our app. It gives you access to all of our CBS News national and local streams for free anytime, anywhere.